Hi everyone, I'm Sam from RISE, your one-stop shop for all your customer engagement activities. RISE provides a robust loyalty solution, helping you easily increase repeat purchase rate and lifetime spent by motivating your customers with rewards. RISE uses store credit rewards that accumulate on your customer's account, allowing them to easily redeem store credit. Now this, as opposed to a points and discount rewards, creates much more sleek and straightforward experience and will definitely increase redemption rates. In this video, we're going to review RISE's loyalty and rewards solution and how you can easily set it all up on your end. First off, I'm going to cover the most important part for you, which is how RISE can help you engage your customers with your rewards program, making them active and loyal customers. Let's see what it looks like. We recommend enabling our rewards widget, which will appear on most of the pages of your website. The widget is the first channel for your customers to interact with your loyalty program. Here, customers can learn about all promotions running in your store and find their loyalty balance. When a customer is not logged in, there will be a card in the widget encouraging customers to sign up to your store. This will direct them to your store's registration page. Alternatively, customers that already have an account can be directed to your sign-in page. Rise integrates seamlessly with your native Shopify accounts. This means customers do not need to sign up for two separate accounts, making it easier for them and you to manage. Once signed in, the widget presents the outstanding store credit balance your customer has and their loyalty card code, as well as their referral link they can use to share with friends. Customers with an account will also be able to find their loyalty code and check the amount of store credit they have in your store on their account page with the store credit button. In this pop-up, customers can also insert any gift cards they have and merge them with their loyalty card code to make it easier for them to redeem their credit. To redeem store credit, customers simply insert their loyalty code in the gift card box at checkout. They can copy the code from the widget, their account page, and from all the store credit emails they've received. You can also use our quick apply button. This will allow customers that are logged in to apply their store credit with the press of a button in the cart before checkout. For Shopify Plus merchants, this button can appear in the checkout page. This button creates a no-code experience, making redeeming store credit seamless and straightforward. This definitely helps increase conversion rate, decrease time on checkout length, and encourages your customers to use their rewards. You can also add a check balance page where your customers who don't have any account can check how much store credit they have in your store by inserting their loyalty card code. In order to reflect the value your customers receive by being a part of your brand's loyalty program, we strongly suggest you advertise your store's promotions on your home page so all of your customers can get excited about it. All these store assets allow customers to easily learn more about your loyalty program and is a great way for your customers to access their loyalty information. This will definitely help increase conversion rate and encourage your customers to use their rewards. Once a customer is rewarded with store credit, a branded and customized email with their reward will be sent to them. You can customize these emails with our email builder in the Rise dashboard. Now, let's move on to how you can easily set up your rewards in the backend. From your Rise dashboard, go to the Loyalty and Rewards tab. As you can see, Rise provides you with a variety of different loyalty flows that you can choose from, according to your brand's needs and goals. For example, if you are interested in increasing your store's AOV, you can use our workflow created specifically for that. This is a simple yet effective workflow that rewards customers with bigger rewards the more they spend in one purchase. This is a great way to incentivize your customers to purchase that extra item that will bring their card value up enough to receive a better reward, and will help you capitalize on every acquired customer. If you want to nail the first impression your customers get from your store, you can use our first purchase reward that rewards your customers for their first purchase. You can make that first impression even better by rewarding your customers who create an account on your store with our Create Account Get Reward workflow. Another amazing program you can set up is our referral program. Make customers that love your brand into brand ambassadors by inviting them to spread the word about your company and rewarding them for every new customer they bring. You can also reward the referred friend to make sure it is extra worthwhile for them to purchase in your store. This will help you expand your customer base and easily acquire new customers. Another great option is the VIP loyalty program. 
This workflow rewards customers based on lifetime spent, making it worthwhile to be a loyal customer at your store. The workflow adds tags to your customers when they achieve each reward, helping you manage your customers and provide them with specialized rewards in the future. To customize the loyalty assets presented on your site, go to the Loyalty Asset tab on the Rise dashboard. In the Quick Apply section, you can edit the text and appearance of the Quick Apply button that will appear in your cart or checkout page. In the Rewards widget section, you can edit all of the text that appears in the different cards of the widget. You can switch from Visitor to Signed In Member here to change the appearance of the widget for customers who are and are not signed in. To each text section, you can add a variable from the variable list, such as customer name and store credit code. To add the variable, you can simply click on the copy button and paste in the desired location. You can remove a card in the widget by making it as hidden in the toggle on the top of the card customization section. In the referral card section, you can choose to customize the card that will appear to your customers who already have generated the referral link and to the customers who have not yet generated their link. You can also customize the appearance of this card for visitors that have not signed into your store account. Moving to the template tab, here you can customize the appearance of the widget in the theme section. Here you can change the header image and the font family and size. You can click on the colors box to change the widget's colors. In the placement section, you can change the placement and orientation of the widget. You can change the widget's position to left or right and change the vertical and horizontal placement by changing the Y and X spacing. In the launcher section, you can add a photo to the floating widget, change the text, or if you'd like, you can remove the text altogether. In the account page section, you can customize all of the text and colors of the account page pop-up. That's only the tip of the iceberg when it comes to our loyalty program options. If you have any questions, we'll be happy to talk with you through our chat or email. We also have an extensive knowledge base where you can find more information. Check out our other videos to learn more about Rise's features.